The F-35 is the new fifth generation state-of-the-art fighter aircraft. It's the newest aircraft being built for the United States Air Force. Fifth generation involves stealth technology, sensor fusion, advanced abilities to talk to other platforms. It takes warfighting to an entire new level for the United States Air Force. It really is the tip of the spear when it comes to aerial combat capability. By using the airspace, by using the training that we have up at the Grayling Range, integrating with the capabilities that are inherent at Battle Creek with the cyber and the RPA missions there, it would tie a lot of the defense equities of the state together and make sure that we have a robust defense industry in this state for probably the next three decades. Stationing the F-35 at Selfridge would benefit our country and our military in a big way. Keeping this type of leading edge technology in a community-based force allows us to be economical to provide that capability. When the nation calls and needs us, we can answer that call like we've proven through the years to give that state-of-the-art capability at a fraction of the cost. We allow our military to be leaner, meaner, and better. Selfridge Air National Guard Base is very unique for an Air National Guard facility. Not only do we run the airfield, but this entire installation with our 40 plus tenant organizations that we have here. So we can operate the F-35 off of our airfield and not have to worry about security or conflicts with civilian traffic. We're strategically positioned here in the Midwest, right next to Lake St. Clair, right next to all these lines of communication with access to fantastic ranges and airspace to our north that have training capability that simply cannot be matched anywhere else. When you look around our state at the military capabilities, the F-35 is the way to fuse all these capabilities together to give our taxpayers the biggest bang for the buck. Selfridge Air National Guard Base has a rich history. In fact, this year marks 100 years as Selfridge has been a continually operating military airfield. It started off training pilots for World War I in fighter aircraft. Through World War II, through the Korean War, Vietnam War, Cold War, up until Operation Enduring Freedom, Selfridge has served in the leading edge of our nation's defense. I think Michigan residents should be excited to be the future home of the F-35. We have wonderful facilities, we have great ranges, we have the ability to train and employ this aircraft properly, but most importantly, we have the best people in the Department of Defense working for us here. Our community airmen, 70% of work out in the community or part-timers with us have proven that they can do the job. What this would show is that our DOD and our government trust Selfridge and the 127th Wing to be the leading edge of our defense for the foreseeable future.